What's up everybody, welcome back to another episode of Just Saying. Today we're gonna find out if we are rich or broke because we will be talking about... Let's start with who do you think here makes the most money before Oh, we can play that game where one, two, three, then everyone point at the richest. That's yeah. what we're doing, yeah, yeah, right? So I think. Exactly okay, what I just yes. <laughs> One, two, two three. three. Kisha. <laughs> Wait, Kisha. Sweet. From Sweet. Yeah. Okay, okay, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. She so one month got one wheel, she will make Correct. more than some people make in a year. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, you say how much you want? <laughs> Since we think that you make the most money, how do you manage your finance? Do you have a rule? To be very honest with you, I don't really have a system of how I manage my money. Before I buy something, I'll be like, yeah, I know I have like the extra money to buy this, so just buy that. But I do don't you have the is it a 50, 20, 30? No, I don't have that. Okay, Same. so what is this 50? No, 20, no, 30. 20 you say. Same. Okay, so you want your one month salary, All right. 50% is you pay for what you need to pay for. Which is your bills, yeah. insurance, or whatever. 30% is your expenses, 20% is what you say. Do you follow that? No. I learned this 10% rule where whatever you want to buy, if it's more than 10% of what you have in your bank, then you buy. Less than 10% you mean? Oh, no, yeah, if it's less or 10%. Yes. I heard from Jay-Z, like, don't buy it unless you can afford it twice. Oh, that that's sense, what like, Jay-Z said. I would live by that, that's clever. Yeah, so for example, if I have to buy a car for $100,000, I will have to have $1 million in my bank to afford $100,000. Mm, okay, for me okay. to be okay, that's the rule I follow when I'm buying shoes. Because I feel like the most money, where my money goes, is legit my very expensive hobby, which is collecting shoes. Like. But wait, wait, what? You spend the most money a month on shoes? Is that yeah, okay, no, no, okay, okay, right now. You have yeah, yeah, two okay, it's not the biggest. But oh, it's yeah, like the same thing right. that you splurge on. Like yeah. the biggest one. Oh my god, I was like, are you spending more on shoes than on rent. Kisha, what are your vices? Okay, don't say rent or anything lah. Like the one you Like the fun stuff. On. My fun stuff. Yeah. Travel. Oh uh, yeah, I guess traveling. But aside from like travel, I wouldn't say that I buy a lot of things for myself because I don't really find it fun. For me, I don't know why. But like if it's clothes, I, I prefer to buy clothes that will last me a long time. So I do spend a bit more on clothes. Mm -hmm. So I don't buy really much. But I know that it's going to last me for a long time. Because you were talking about Shein just now. Shein is a great brand of No, but you have to understand. I buy one $6 top from Shein, right? It's going to f***ing like break. And I'm going to buy a gate. Had it for like years. And it's you what, tumble dry or what? The wash person front load or top load? Great. Oh, and oh my god, cat food. Okay uh -huh. guys, so you know I have eight cats, right? Their f food mm -hmm. is so expensive. Yeah, having animals is expensive. It is. It's expensive. You, you know what? It's expensive. Children. Yeah, I want to say. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. 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 you know how much the school fees is for a school that he goes to until 12 o'clock every day? It's 2001 a month. Oh my god, this is preschool. Yeah, preschool. Mm. Like the local kindergartens are very far from my house. Mm. So like the ones that are near my house are Ethan House, which is mm. 2005. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah. that's Children. like a, you know, fresh yeah. grad. And children because they're really sensitive to like a lot of things like hormones and chicken yeah. and stuff. Which oh. means every time I go to the f market, I have to buy sakura chicken because oh, wow. it doesn't have to smell, it doesn't have like hormones. Oh wow. Then after that, there's like their side hobbies, what they want to do. So he's like in baby soccer, baby oh, swimming. So cute! <laughs> so cute. Yeah. Really expensive. And then like, I don't know lah, like there's a million things that you only realise that you have to pay for when yeah. you're parent. Like buying sakura brand chicken. Wow. So I do you feel like you're spending $6, more $6, on $6, the baby yeah. than yeah. yourself yeah. now? Yeah. Oh, because no. the way that I would budget by finances is yeah. like money first. Uh, okay. But I have yeah. a tip for like when you want to spend on fun things, right? Like my biggest splurge will always be either household things or actually just household things. Oh my god! You know what? I love, love like home things like furniture. So oh I will my splurge god, like vacuum. Like nice that. Dyson vacuum. Yes, everything. Every time you use it, I'm like, yes, is the best thing. Like I would really like not yeah. mind spending on that because I feel like it's a long term thing also. But I have a tip because what you do is you look for what you want and you wait for the sale. So like for example, Dyson also have a sale. They will. Yeah, you just go on Lazada, they always have this monthly sale. The sale like, is not angry. Like but the sale, that's the most you can get. Yeah, and so... Yeah, but after trip. like I move out and now I buy my own groceries, I realise actually groceries are also quite expensive. Yeah, yeah. everything like, in life yeah, is very expensive. Yeah, yeah, and like when I go to like NTC, right, and I'm like 100 bucks, I'm like what But you got passion card because you can get yeah, more yeah, 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 yeah. Better card. get passion card. Right. Oh, like what are your current financial goals? I want to retire. Soon? Maybe by the time I'm 40. Does that include finding a rich boyfriend or what? No. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody loves me. Every time she pretends to cry, she will really cry. 
But anyway, my idea of retirement is being able to do something completely different. I have something in mind already that I really want to do. Wow, what? I cannot say lah. I'm very like. But, but it's sometimes better don't say. Yeah, that's why I better don't say. That's like me. Yeah. You guys know, I've always wanted to. I mean, I'm not. I'm not even there yet. I don't have a boyfriend, but. Mary, <laughs> yeah, no, it's uh, you no, I don't know why. You made. Oh, but why? Hey, give me all that. Give you go R O M lah. Finish. I never save up my budget. You ask the question for her. Okay lah, okay lah. Okay. So I was insulting her also. Basically, ah yes, baby. Right now, I want to save up because I know Jade said that having a child is expensive, and I know I want children. Oh. So that's where my money is gonna be pushed towards. Okay. He's so mean, ah. Very bad, man. Serious. You, you were like. Jenny, Jenny. I, I, just, I, have, I have two modes. Okay. One mode is when I wake up, I'm like, I'm very happy and there's nothing I want to buy. The other mode is like, I really want John Legend to play at my wedding. And then it's gonna be f uh, cases. I have two modes, really two modes. I'm John like, Legend? Why? Why not? Why not? Why and John Legend at your wedding. But for Jade, you bro. ask what our dreams are. Like and Nicki then Minaj you just shake on her. Yeah, and actually. Yeah, dude, yeah, you, yeah, you are evil, you know. You don't like the answer. You ask us for me, Ask. No, I'm, I know. Yeah. There's a good answer. Just like, it oh, is a good John answer. Yeah. Okay, okay. So I, you want John Legend? Have you ever like woken up and like, you know who I really want to play my wedding? John Legend. John Mayer. Never, like, we like, never, John Mayer, never but thought they of it. But what would I do? But yeah, I see why you want. Now. Yeah, correct. Okay, my, my um, financial goals uh, um, I don't know man Obviously it was car la. Like sometimes you wake up and you're like I want a car Then sometimes you wake up and you're like I'm very happy Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I don't need a car Then sometimes I wake up and like, I want a car Yeah, mm. and every time when I come to filming When I'm carrying equipment I'm like, I should have bought a car Wait, right, right, you right, can right. call a grab which I do, yeah. but what? Uh, the idea of carrying it and everything just... But you still have to carry it down to your car. No, but when I go and collect it, I just leave it in my car. But now I have to carry it carry it down and everything. Ah yeah, got this so one. So much work. Okay. Are you making fun of me? No, you make fun of me! I'm not wanting to have children! I never made fun of her! She you for not wanting to I carry... I made fun of her before she said she wanted children. Me. It's totally different. Is it bad? No, I see so much work that he has to carry it up and down. Do you have to carry children up but, and down? Do you? With okay, the yeah. amount of money that you guys are earning now, you guys obviously want to earn more. Is it wrong for me to say I don't plan on earning more? It, it's no, wrong, right? if that's how you plan, you don't want to earn more. I'm just very happy. More. It's not that I wouldn't like more money. If someone yeah. was like walk through the door and I was like, Jake, here's a million dollars, yeah. I'm not going to say go away. Yeah. But the thing is, I don't want to earn more if it's going to mean sacrificing my time. Yeah. Like, which okay, is okay, I understand. Where I'm yeah. no longer like, I want to earn more. I'm more like, I want to maintain and I don't want to do more jobs. Yeah. But I just. I'm Which is good because like I feel not many people are always they don't have contentment and people mm. don't realize that contentment is because you're content creator. Content. <laughs> But I do think if you guys want to actually invest in money, right? I would rather have my money sitting in a bank account rather than making wrong investments. So I do mm. think where you're channeling your money is very, very important. How are you with risk? I feel like I don't take enough risks. I'm very uh, careful. So like for the longest time, I've been wanting to go into investing. But I'm just like, no knowledge whatsoever, right? Mm. So what I recently got into was Scythe. And so when I did join them, I bought a portfolio, but mainly because of of how adjustable it mm. is. Like me as a new investor, you don't know how much you want to put in in the first place because I'm very scared, right? Mm. But with Scythe, like there's no minimum, minimum amount that you can put in. Like $1, okay. Yeah, yeah. I mean like, but then you won't see any like mm. returns from that. But but would they tell you a specific amount of returns that they will get? So there's a wealth expert that will be able to talk to you and talk you through all the portfolio. Mm. The good thing is that I still get a choice because there's a little calculator that you can put in like, oh, okay, okay, if I put in like 10K, how much will I get in maybe like seven years? So you can totally like play with it and good. it's a rough idea of how much you can make. Oh, is that like kind of like just like a bank The difference is like, for example, if people want to invest in a hedge yeah. fund, you need a f ton of money. But I like how this one tells you. Yeah, you the... can also put in more, like, okay, so for me, what got me was there's no minimum amount. At any point of time, you can take it out. But it's an app lah, basically. Yeah, it's okay, an app. Okay, it's a robot app. advisor Yes, yeah, so yeah, like you said, like you put it in and then like someone just handles it for you. And it's been like good so far. But of mm, course, okay. like going into investments, you need to know like, yeah, things will drop here yeah. and there. Mm. But I feel like because I'm very like kiasu and like are you sure? Are you sure? Mm. So like now that I actually see like results, like yeah. things like going up, and I'm like okay, fine. I'm a bit more brave to like go into it because I trust them a bit more. I never understood all this advisor stuff, but okay, I don't know whether the other apps have it, but yeah. that that whole you can see how much you earn in ten years. I yeah. think that one. Yeah, I love like, it. Yeah, I, I will buy it. Really. I feel like when people talk talk to me about like crypto and everything, yeah. while I am semi interested in it, mostly I'm like. Ah, 
lucky, you know, I don't want to put money because I don't understand it. But I think if they have kind of a very small function, I feel like, ah, okay, you know. Because for me, right, if I do play this kind of things, I just don't give my money and not do anything. Yeah, correct. Yeah. Because like, if you need to keep checking, and I have had friends who are just constantly watching, like you just don't have time for that, right? You want to yeah. have peace of mind to like, okay, I put my money with someone I yeah. trust, yeah. they can help you make your money grow in the long term. I also oh, think that cool. it's good that they don't have a minimum because like, I feel it's important, especially like the younger people who have just started working yeah. and yeah. they finally amass a certain amount of money and they just not using that. And yeah. I think it's very important lah because like, yeah, we're in this line where, you know, like money is a thing that we need to strive for all the time. You know what is so scary? I read that like the number of millionaires in Singapore is expected to increase to don't know how many percent like a majority of Singaporeans obviously it's yeah. because they own a house but like it's just like so scary that like Singapore is like progressing and like everybody is getting richer and richer but the thing is when society gets richer the things in that society that you need to buy the yeah. food the housing it all gets more expensive and yeah. I've always I'm always afraid like oh I'm not investing so am I getting left behind mm. and I don't know if anyone else can like really because I'm not growing my money like what I yeah. earn is what I earn I'm not gonna yeah. earn more than this like all oh, my Mola, friends like, are yeah. making mm. this money and mm. I'm not making this money I'm I'm losing out. Why I, I have that fear, again, I never really invested before. My investment is, for example, Durian. Start a Durian brand, if it sells, it sells, and then yeah. it does it. Does it like? Never really got into like putting money in. I never scared. Eh. So yeah. tip, right, guys? If you want to invest in anything, just make sure it'll be comfortable enough to lose. Yeah, money. that's what uh, I was gonna yeah. say. So no, but I feel like also if you want to do this kind of things, right, you need to know what you want to use the money for. Like you put a, a number to it. For example, yeah. like me starting do rent. In my head, I'm like, as long as I can pay rent, I'm good. But you know, then every month I don't have to worry about rent, right? Or like a goal, yeah. even like you want to yeah. earn enough money for retirement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or to yeah. get a house. Yeah. For know? example, let's yeah. say. If you're saving $100 a month and you think like, okay, you know what? For me to buy something, I need to save $500 a month. That other $400 can come from investment. That's, that's how I, I look at it. Uh. <laughs> Affirmation. Uh. So you come to the end of this episode. I hope you guys liked it. If you guys are interested in using Scythe, you can go to the App Store and download it. And if you use our code just saying 20 you will get $20 cash bonus when you invest more than $1,000. The code will appear here. Where? Here lah. Okay. You put here. Yeah. yeah. Wait, <laughs> then up it's here. up there. Okay. <laughs> we hope you guys like this episode. If you guys have anything you would like us to talk about, let us know in the comment section below. If not, we'll see you in the next episode. Bye. You guys obviously never watched it until the end before. Right?